Hello again, welcome back to Ants Trails. And I was checking some of my lake captures from, I believe it would have been maybe around August, September time where I caught these four queens together. Um, and I popped them all in one test tube and put them away for the winter, obviously. And I've recently discovered that they are all awake, which is quite early. I mean, the date is now, I believe, is it's around the 16th, 17th yeah, of February. So, yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty good, actually. So I'm just going to try and uncover them a moment and then focus in my camera. So my camera can see properly because otherwise you're not going to see much at all, are you? And if you look there, you can see that they have been awake for some time, I imagine. And there you go. Look at all those eggs and pupae. And larvae in different stages. Some of these are about ready to start cocooning. These are from my Gafuska. Four queens. All very happy in there, as you can see. And of course these will live together. Which is fantastic. If I had uh, put four Lassius Niger in there, then by now there probably would have only been one Lassius Niger. So they tend to kill each other. But these... Formica Fusca will live together, which is fantastic. It's really good to have a starting colony with four queens. I mean, you can see the brood is huge and they're about to start. I do believe some of them might actually be queens. Now, some of those larvae are rather large. Look at them communicating there and touching each other. Reassuring each other that everything's okay. Feeding the babies. Such tentative mothers. Social insects are great mothers. Absolutely fantastic. Of course, they're all programmed to be that way, but... It's absolutely fantastic. Look at the way she just holds that larvae in her mandibles. Touching it constantly with the antennae. Feeds it, grooms it. Of course, they have antiseptic in their saliva, which helps them maintain the eggs free from mold and uh, other nasties. Yeah, I just thought that would be quite interesting for you guys to see anyway. There's a heck of a lot of eggs and brood. I'm sorry about my shaky camera work. I'm going to try and get a little bit closer to that one. Of course, I'm doing this all on a really small cell phone. Ah, oh, Look at the way she's just stacking them up. She knows exactly which ones she's looking for as well. See how she sifts through them all. And she finds the ones that she wants. Uh, yeah, they are big larvae there. They are large larvae. I wouldn't be surprised if they were queens. I honestly wouldn't. But yeah, it's been a little update video on Fumica Fusca in my, one of my test tubes. I can't wait till the spring starts. It's coming, guys. It is coming. Spring is coming. Ant season is almost upon us. Get your test tubes ready. And get ready for it. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed. And I'll catch you on the next one. Bye bye.